All right. Welcome back, everybody. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, wherever you are. Thanks for joining me. All right, quick shout out to everybody. And I'm talking to everybody that watched the last video and made comments on the last video. I appreciate it. Um, it's really nice to have such uh, interaction with you guys. And um, I just wanted to talk about something that I'm noticing it's kind of a almost a guarantee when you get these these packs. Another good reason to, to search for them and, and pick them up when you get a chance. Um, in the last video, the comment section alone had a lot of really interesting information from a lot of different uh, viewers. Um, I would urge you, if you haven't watched the video, go back and watch it. But even if you don't watch it, you know, that's fine. Look at the comment section. Read the comments. There were some really um, interesting books that a lot of the uh, viewers were finding um, in these packs. Um, my man D Daniel, for instance, um, you have to check it out. He found he's found like he's got he's got the magic touch, man. He's found a bunch of good stuff. So um, check it out. Check out the uh, comment section and um, and see what I'm talking about. You know, uh, you find really cool things in these packs. You know, right now you can see I have my Moon Knight facsimile, which I just recently got. Finally, I've got a, da a Dazzler facsimile, which I got it not too long ago. Uh, which is kind of cool. Um, I like the fact Stanley books are really, really nice to get. Um, just something different. Uh, and give you a flashback to the good old days of comic book collecting. And uh, here's the one thing that is almost a guarantee, man. Like you're always going to get like one of these books, it seems, in, in the pack. And those are second printings. Okay. Now, second printings aren't necessarily a bad thing. Sometimes it's a good thing. Sometimes a second print comic book is worth more than the first print comic book. Okay, and in a, a perfect example of why I like these packs is this one right here. Okay, this is number five, second printing of Sam Wilson Captain America, which is the first appearance of the new Falcon. Awesome. Okay, and yes, my man's going to be making his way into the MCU in the new Captain America. New World Order movie. Um, I don't have any inside information, but dog, I will be, I will be stunned if this gentleman does not show up in that movie. It's all, all the, all the hours are pointing the right way. Okay. So the other thing is, um, you know, you just don't know. You don't, you just don't know, man. You just don't know what you're gonna get in these packs. So it's good to pick them up. Just grab them. They're eight dollars, nine dollars, or I should say. And uh, you get some really good stuff. Listen, if it was up to me, I'd have nobody buy them, and I'd have my choice of everything when I go to, to Walmart. But you know, I want I want everyone to enjoy this and go out there and grab them. And uh, the video that's going to follow this video was um, a pack that I found a while ago, and I never opened it. And then when I was uh, going through my my phase here where there were no comic books to be found at Walmart in my area. I couldn't find anything. I pulled out this pack that hadn't been opened. I was like, oh, you know what? Let me just pop it open and see. Let's see what's in it, you know? Um, I had a couple of them that were just laying around. And uh, so I went ahead and opened it and didn't post the video because I wasn't really excited about it because I thought, eh, nothing really great. But it turns out I was wrong. So watch this video coming up after this. And, and then go out there and do some research on it, and you'll see what I'm talking about. All right, guys, have a great day, and I will see you next time. Oh, hey, wait, one more thing, real quick. Just to clarify, I did not get this Sam Wilson Captain America or this extermination in a recent pack that I opened. Okay, this is from packs from back in the day. I just didn't want you guys to think to rush out there and try to find them, and they're not in the recent packs. You know, they, they could be. But I did not get them out of a recent pack. I got these from packs from about a year ago. Okay? Just want to clarify. Let's try this again. Let's go to the next video. Let me show the front first of all. So this pack I've had for a while. Didn't realize I had it. It was kind of jammed up between a couple books I had there. So um, let's open it. Maybe I've been sitting this whole time on a very expensive key comic book that's in this pack. Maybe I've had this whole entire time. I never knew it. I don't think so. To save time and because I don't want you guys to see me struggling with my, my uh, weak, dull blades, I decided to cut it a little bit before the video so it'll make it a little bit easier to open. So. Alrighty. 
So as you know, this goes back a long time ago. This is right before we started getting all those hot variants. All right. So of course I already have this issue. Um, it's a great cover, you know, Ron Lim cover. It's a beautiful looking cover for Alien. Um, not a bad book either. But let's see what else we got here. Doctor Dune number one, second printing. Okay, I don't have this issue, but I don't think there's anything really significant about it. But I'm gonna read it all the same. Let's see who the artist is on the inside. Salvador La Roca. Okay, all right, cool. We'll give this a shot. One, two. Three, ay, yay, yay, Empire number one, variant edition. I have like three of these. I do love Ed McGinnis's cover. It's a great looking cover, but I have this first issue in so many different <laughs> variants and different forms. Looks like I've got another one. Okay. Well, I've been sending this book, this pack for a while, and uh, I can honestly say nothing major was here. All right, guys. Have a good night.